Hey guys, this is going to be a short, easy video just to show you guys how to use a PlayStation 3 controller on your computer. So I'm going to leave a link in the description, but the first thing you have to do is download Motion Enjoy's DS3 tool. But uh, I have it right over here, so I'll show you. You open it up, it'll look like this. You want to go to Driver Manager, and then make sure obviously your controller is plugged in, the USB port. Then you should find it here check it and hit load driver and then it will install the drivers you need uh, to get it to work and so now you can test it there's a couple different ways to test it you can see some of the configuration in the profiles if you make sure to hit PlayStation 3 over here then you can see all the options you can also go to let's see game controllers to test out it should say motion enjoy and then if you check this out, this is me hitting the buttons. You can see all the things over there. There's the access and everything. So once that's all set up, you should be good. Uh, so first thing to note is that to make it work with certain applications, you know, it, it can be difficult depending on how it works. Uh, the real difficulty is button mapping. You won't really be able to do button mapping without an outside program. So for that, I recommend XPatter right here. Um, so this is a really easy program to use. Um, not, I'm not going to do a whole video on it, but it very simply it just lets you configure any button on your controller to any button on your keyboard. So that lets me do whatever I need to do. Um, this program is not free. This program is ten dollars. I'm not going to say how to how you can get it in other ways, but that's just to keep, let you know. Although this is a great program. And with it, you can pretty much use your controller on anything you want. And I'll just show a quick example. Put up my Bashi profile. Uh oh. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to go in here. And you'll see on the left, the buttons will flash as I use them. So you can see, I'm just using the, you know, axis and the controller and everything. So, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, it's very easy to do. It took me about two minutes. Um, you might have some technical difficulties. If you do, let me know in the comments below. But yeah, that's about it. I'll see you guys later.